Yo, what is up guys? It's Chugs, and in today's video, it's going to be an update to the Astro HDMI adapter, which they silently freaking updated without, without telling anybody, which sucks. But anyways, before I begin that, I just want to say Merry Christmas to each and every one of you. Hope you guys had a good time with your family, your friends, had all the good food, got everything you wanted, and if you didn't, it's all good. You have next year to look forward to, but if you had a PS5 today... Or if you got a PS5 on the way, or if you got a PS5 pre-order that's on the way, I have some super good news for you. Check this out. So Astro Gaming Blog, this was this was posted on 1210. I made a video about the the last Astro HDMI adapter they posted like 12. I should have it right here. 10 20 20 20. Basically, I, my old video was about this blog right here saying um, everything was capped at 60 FPS, uh, 1080p, 720p. 4K, yada, yada, yada. So this new blog that came out, I'll just skip to the good stuff. Going down, going down, going down, going down. This right here is a breakdown of what, so if you have like a HDMI 2.13 or 1.4, 2.0, it'll let you know resolution, uh, the refresh rate, and how much data is required for it to transfer things. But get to the good part right here. So if we read this part right here, take it into account what is possible on the PS5 today. Here are the resolutions and frame rates you can, you can expect to be supported with the Astro HDMI adapter. So 720p, 120Hz. 1080p, 120Hz. Ding, ding, ding. I mean, that's the best part right there. And 4K is still 60Hz. Wow. So now they confirmed everything. On my last video, I said that it, it was capped at 60Hz. So if you're on the fence about getting this, I say get it now. So especially if you are using a Elgato or whatever... A video capture card you're using you are going to want this so you can have your sound output to hdmi and still have your mic working at the same time uh, when recording so get it guys what are you waiting for it's they have it at best buy i, th I still think astro sold out i haven't checked but these are still running for 40 bucks i think it's worth it i've been using it since day one um the only thing i have to bring up is there isn't a confirmed list of monitors that are compatible with the ps5 because a lot of people are still trying to plug them in, and it's still only pushing 60 hertz. No matter what they do, they put it on performance mode, they put it on 1080p, restart the game, they make sure it's a, the PS5 game for Black Ops and all that good stuff, and nothing works. But if you know your monitor works, and you want to record um, on your your uh, game capture card, this is a go. I mean, you honestly don't need this if you're just gonna use the PS5. I have tested it myself, where all you need is a USB, and the sound is amazing. Like make sure your, your mix app is just on um, on stereo. You want to turn off Dolby Digital so you can have left and right sounds. The Tempest chip in the PS5 will enhance the audio 1,000%. It sounds so amazing. But yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope this video was helpful. Like, subscribe, game, peace. Merry Christmas, y'all. <laughs>